Well, there's a unique event happening today in Carlsbad. Yeah, it's called the Blind Surf Event, and it's helping people with visual impairment. The waves. Danny Roberti is there now checking it out for us. Good morning, Danny. Hey, good morning to you, Ginger and Jason. You guys have already seen it's been an incredible morning so far. Um, if you didn't get a chance to hear Scott's story a little bit earlier on, it gives me chills even thinking about it. Uh, he's one of the blind surfers that are here today that gets out there in the water and he surfs out there. He cannot see at all. He had an incredible, inspiring story. Today we are at Ponto Beach in Carlsbad, and this is where we are actually bringing together people who can't see, visually impaired, uh, adults, children, and they're actually learning how to surf. And how does that all work? Well, I brought in Shay right here, and the music now is getting going, so you can tell that the party's getting started. But we've got behind us a lot of the volunteers who are actually just getting ready to help. What is their job today, Shay? Volunteers' job is giant right now. What we what we do is we get six sur six volunteers per blind surfer. So we have a captain and five surfers that basically allow the blind surfer to catch a wave. And what we, what the other five do is they're basically catchers and they're releasers. So when you do when the blind surfer is pushed into a wave, um, we're there basically as to catch them or back them up. So they give them that comfort of the ocean and you know riding a wave without feeling in danger. So yeah, it's really cool. And that is so awesome. Okay, so uh, how many, sir, or how many volunteers are for one person? We have uh, six volunteers per one person, per okay. one surfer. So, yeah, the captain in the front, two on the side, and one on the tail to catch them. So, so what are you guys making sure you do when you go out there? Um, well, number one, rule shuffle, stingray shuffle. And then yeah. number two is comforting the, the blind surfer, whether, you know, asking their limits, hey, are you um, impaired? Are you, you know, are you fully blind? Um, knowing, are you, hey, is this your first time in the ocean? Because sometimes, you know, I mean, for, for some of them, they've never even touched the ocean, never been to the beach before. So it's gigantic. It's very emotional. I'm full comfort in, you know, that, hey, we're here for you and we want you to have fun. You said emotional. What's it like? Um, I know you've been out there with them. When you see someone who's never been in the water, who can't see, you see them stand up for the first time. Oh, you, you, you can't even describe it. I mean, this the look on their face, the smile. I mean, it's, just a, it's an everlasting emotion that you have, you know, built up in there. I mean, it's just... Just not, you know, I've, I've been surfing for 35 years, and just to have somebody that has never been to the beach before, I mean, and just to stand up on a wave, it's like, well, I've been doing that for so long, and this person just gets to, you know, enjoy what it's like out there. It's a jewel. I mean, it's just amazing. You know, I mean, the first time you do it, it's just like, first time you just get the feel of the wave, it's just, it's just such a rush, you know? You're like, wow, it's, it's almost like riding a roller coaster. It's crazy. It's really cool. So, yeah. So, so now as we, can you kind of walk me through what's going on right now? Yeah. So, Our, um, yeah. So, so what we're doing right now, we're getting all the teams together. They're assembling, you know, five, like I said, there's a one team captain and five surfers. Okay. We're getting our rash guards on. We're going to get the boards ready, whether, we're, you know, all of them are going to have a leash. So we obviously, you know, besides having the five people around them to, to support them and catch them, yeah. you know, we need to make sure that, you know, ocean safety is up, you know, oh, most important. Exactly. So, yeah, so we're going to spread out. We're going to go um, six different spots along the beach. Okay. Um, based on how many surfers the waves look amazing waves look absolutely phenomenal so um it's a little bit of a lower tide so we're actually e it's easier to push the uh, the surfers in right now instead of having a higher tide which has a shore break which kind of you know kind of dumps on the sand so right now we're going to get you know we're going to get a longer ride out there um a little flatter so yeah it's just going to be great you know, a, lot, a lot easier too so good 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 that's awesome thank you so so much um we are we're excited to see them getting out there and actually i want to go check in with I want you, Levecki, if you would be able to turn the camera. Uh, Scott is getting ready. This is who we just talked to a few minutes ago. Um, how incredible is it to see Scott getting out there in the water? Scott is amazing. He's an amazing person, but he's an amazing surfer. I mean, I've, I've been doing this with Scott and with um, the whole crew for years now. And just watching him you know, at the blind surf or at the championships, this guy is just, he's an animal. I mean, he gets out there and give me this wave, give me this wave, and he goes, you know, it's just, it's just really, really cool. And something that just amazed me about him, and I'm sure you'll agree, is just how much joy he has. Yep. For everything he's gone through, he just he maintains his joy and his fight and his fire. And I just, I can't understand how. Yeah, it's seriously, it's, he's just so stoked. I mean, that's the word that you, I mean, I just, it's really hard to describe, but I mean, he's just, 
it feeds on you. You know, you just walk by him and you see him surf and just just walking and talking to people and sharing his story. It's just it's just contagious. I mean, you just you can't leave the beach without feeling this. I mean, you just want to jump up with joy. I mean, this guy's a, he's a legend, so it's really cool. So cool. Thank you so much, Jay. We're uh, we're getting ready because everyone is getting their rash guards, their wetsuits on. Scott's getting ready to go out there in the water and show you what he's got. Such an incredible morning. So many inspiring stories here. We're actually going to be talking to a few more people that are here for the first time, that are blind, that are getting ready to get out there in the water. Maybe we'll see some more dolphins coming through. Uh, but I'm also really excited to show you guys Scott and his incredible story and what he's going to be doing out there in the water. Beautiful day in Carlsbad. Couldn't have asked for better weather. All you've got is sunshine. We're going to be in the 70s today, and it's going to be a great day for the beach. So stick with us. We're going to be showing you some of the folks getting out there in the water coming up here in the next 30 minutes, sending things back to you guys in the studio. Can't wait to see that. All right, Danny, thank you. Thanks, Danny. Well, summer is here.